Should the Crocus album Heart Attack be reissued? This is the Rock and Roll with the Man. My name is Sean Morrison. Came out in 1988 on um, MCA Records. We have some videos here regarding the Heart Attack album. There's a few songs as well as, well as an album review, I believe. But um, album's been long out of print. Like I said, released on MCA Records, the only album they did for MCA. Now owned by Universal Records, of course. And um, a lot of Crocus albums have been, um, you know, still in print, but they're, you know, they're there as well as on the digital download. And this is one album of the Crocus catalog that isn't. If you're not subscribed to the Sean Morrison YouTube channel, please do so. Everyone else out there, subscribe. Thank you very much for your continued love, honor, and support. It's greatly appreciated. If you'd like to make a small donation to the Sean Morrison YouTube channel, kindly do so via Sean Morrison Enterprises via PayPal. Also, of course, change of your address from Arister is also um, not available via digital download either, it seems. If you go on, the, you on YouTube, you don't, you only see fan posted songs of it. The same thing with the Heart Attack album. Great album with the songs um, Everybody Rocks, The Axe Attack. Let It Go. A lot of great songs on it. Ironically, uh, Mr. Morrison did see Crocus on the Heart Attack tour. And this is before he really owned m many records from Crocus, but there was nobody at the show, but he enjoyed himself, even though he didn't play anything off the Change of Address album. It was very interesting. But to answer the question for some fans, um, I'm trying to find out if the Heart Attack album will get reissued. It's a very underrated album. It's an awesome album. Maybe contact Crocus. Maybe they will reissue, reissue Heart Attack or try to do something about it. I believe it has something to do with Universal Records not reissuing the Masters. Thoughts, friends? Shame, shame, shame.